Uh, let me just start out with what we're excited to get started. Uh, we look forward to building on what we accomplished in the spring. Uh, I know our kids are excited to take a next step and uh, you know we'll just see what happens during fall camp but we're very excited so I'm sorry. Your, 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 your learning curve coming in for Kurt and learning the, learning the players and what they do. Uh, well, you know, I mean, January and then into, uh, sure. Uh, well, you know, the first thing, you know, we had to do when we got here was, you know, you know, take a look at the players. Really wasn't concerned about system, what, what, you know, what happened last year, anything like that. Wanted to look at uh, where our strengths were and, you know, if there was any weaknesses, how, how we can improve them and so on. Uh, so, you know, we put our system in, and uh, I would say this, that our kids picked it up extremely well. Uh, most all of our concepts were in. We got them in during the spring. Uh, we'll have some additional defense in fall camp. Uh, you know, really, yeah, I, I don't think it's going to be too hard for them to understand because I was very pleased how well they picked things up. Uh, their coaching, they, the way they take coaching has been outstanding. Uh, their work ethic was very good. And, uh, you know, we'll, we'll continue to build our system through fall camp. And if we could do more, great. If we can't, we still have enough in right now to play a football game. Well, I, I think, you know, you know, if there is concerns, uh, our depth, we've got to continue to develop depth. Uh, you know, we got to continue to develop experience because there is a lot of young guys uh, in the back end uh, that we have to continue to develop and, and, and uh, get our players playing at a higher level. Uh, and, you know, just try to improve our depth. And we have a lot of new guys coming in, and uh, we'll see what happens. I'm not going to make any prediction on who's going to play right now of the new guys coming in. But, uh, you know, off, off their tapes, you know, we're very pleased. What do you look for with a young kid coming in, like a true freshman or a transfer? What, I mean, you know, watch them on film, on field, maybe in a different situation. Yeah, uh, you know, I think the thing you look at is, is uh, you know, I think the mental part is, is critical, you know, because some guys – may look like Tarzan when they come in, but, you know, just aren't quite ready mentally to pick everything up uh, for whatever reason. Uh, it's the guys that are ready mentally and physically that are able to contribute as soon as possible. Are those guys going to jump out at you right away? Or, or take care? Uh, I'm not going to say right away, but I think you'll have an indication early on whether they could do it uh, physically. Then the mental part is uh, – will take place after that. You know, our install starts out slow, then it picks up as we go along. So we'll see. You know, if we got to slow some things down, if we think the kid has a chance to get ready, if we got to slow some things down to get him ready or call certain things when he's in there, we'll do that. We could be flexible that way. Well, I, I think he's a special guy. Uh, you know he's a he's a he's a student of the game. He's he, he, he's smart. He's tough. He's dependable, and uh, he's a playmaker. And I'm very impressed with what I saw him of him in the spring. And and uh, you know hopefully he'll continue to get better through fall camp and as he grows in, in our system.